Hello and welcome to this video. To download Signal, you can go to your Play Store. It's available on iOS and then also on Android and then on Windows and Mac. So you see, I'm registering. You put your phone number. It requires your phone number. So you put your phone number. You change your. You put your username. The username you want to use, and then you just select it. Click on next, then you create your pin. Okay, so you don't need the pin to open the app, it's just like for security purposes or reasons. So, please subscribe to this channel. Please, if you've not subscribed, please click on the subscribe button. We talk on online safety, digital safety, and also expose the latest scams and tricks used by scammers so that's what we do basically on this channel yeah so it's open so see all the features it has it's almost like whatsapp basically it has everything that whatsapp has but the privacy is top notch at least for now uh, so that's why most people are using it signal is used by a lot of people right now in comparison to whatsapp and with this privacy issue that WhatsApp just brought up now, most people are switching to Signal. Even Elon Musk said everyone should start using Signal. So he has basically verified it. So for Signal, as you can see, it almost has the same in interface with um, whatsapp it has almost the same functionality it is better in terms of security as you can and it's open source meaning it's not really owned by a particular company and they get their money via donations donations you give them so this is settings see so donates at the bottom you see donate signal so you can change the appearance see that you want a light or a dark team, anyone you want, I prefer dark team. Then, um, privacy, you can set your screen lock, okay? You can block screenshots, that means nobody will be able to screenshot your what's your messages and all. Then, incognito keyboard is a very good feature. So, in case I using Google keyboard, and then the keyboard, sometimes Google gets to monitor everything you type, okay? So with incognito keyboard, it gets to hide your keystrokes and whatever you type so that no keyboard will monitor whatever you're typing. So read receipts, typing indicators, all these other things are found on WhatsApp. And then the last one here, registration lock, add extra security by requiring your signature. So anytime you, you, let's say you change your device and you want to download the Signal app again, you'll be required to use the old your pin the former pin and your number to register on a new device okay so that's just it and let's see the for example the chat so like i said see how the keyboard looks it shows the incognito because i enabled it but the chat you can you see the emojis it has lots of emojis as you can see lots of emojis and tastic has also see the plus button by the side that can use to add it also has the video call the top left and the normal call so it has every functionality you require. So for those thinking of switching to Signal, it's for now I'm not entirely sure. I'll just keep watching WhatsApp to see if they'll make any update or any change. If not, perhaps I'll make a switch to Signal. But for now, I have both of them and I use both of them. So to share. See, or to invite your friends to use Signal, you click on this top corner, you click on invite friends, 
and then you click on choose how to share so you can share to them via whatsapp or bluetooth or any other platform so that's it